Hey everyone, I'm Freya, and Dr. Melick has asked me to help teach about using facial landmarks to choose the correct pediatric laryngoscope blade length. You have a pediatric trauma coming in, and it sounds like a child's under three years of age. The child's going to need to be intubated. What is the uh, correct blade length size you will need for your laryngoscope? It is not uncommon for physicians to uh, re refer to uh, a Rousel tape to look in a textbook to be basing on experience, but what about using external landmarks? The distance from the upper incisor teeth to the angle of the jaw is an excellent clinical landmark for laryngoscope blade length selection for pediatric intubations. When the blade, excluding the handle insertion block, is placed at the upper midline incisor teeth and the tip is located at the angle of the mandible within one centimeter proximal or distal. Oral tracheal intubations are more consistently accomplished on the first attempt. Please note the insertion blocks for these blades. The insertion blocks are not included in the measurement. Only the actual blade is used. This research article published by Dr. Melick in 2006 is the supporting reference for this recommendation. So, but on this little girl here, what, what size blade do you think we're gonna use? What, what is it you're gonna be looking at um, in making your decision? Uh, so I will use a uh, Miller One straight laryngoscope blade as an example. Uh, the theory is that if you place the base of this laryngoscope blade at the central incisors externally where they would be. Yeah, the upper, um, the upper central incisors. The upper central incisors. That the tip, the distal portion of your blade, will be plus or minus one centimeter to the angle of the jaw. And that's the correct blade length. That will be the correct blade length. Okay. Correct. Uh, again, based on her age, this is just a guesstimate as to whether this will work. Okay, so let's let's put this down next to her and see if she needs a, a bigger one or a smaller one. Wanna go ahead and look up at the sky, sweetie? Very good. Angle of mandible is at my index finger, tip of my index finger. Is, is and the, the block, base, insertion block, is it right at the uh, central incisors of the upper teeth? It is right yeah, there. Right there. Okay. So that is just about probably what she, okay. what she would need. Thank you so much for uh, allowing us to make this teaching video. We appreciate this very much.